Welcome Taurus. This is your soul empowerment for April 2020. I'm coming to you with a little bit of encouragement. God knows we all need it, need it in tense times. So I did something a little different this month and I went ahead and chose your ruling planet and where the signs it's moving into for the month of April. I would like to start out today by welcoming you to my channel and a little bit of encouragement before we go on to your soul empowerment messages for the month of April. Taurus. If you've been ignoring projects or deadlines, get ready for a cosmic kick in the pants. Someone's patience has run out and you'll have to answer for your procrastination and avoidance. Push through. You'll be surprised at what you can accomplish when you set your goals and work towards them. So this little bit of trying to tell you that you got to have some forward momentum. Venus, your ruling planet, right? The part of you that desires beauty indulgence and valuables so this is what you truly value venus to me always represents self-love so keep that in mind taurus your planet will be moving from its home sign of taurus into gemini so we're going from earth energy to air energy for april 2020 taurus i wanted to also say i forgot to say this this can go for your sun moon rising um, also, Venus cross watchers are always welcome because we're made up of all four elements. All astrological signs are in our natal charts and all planets have an impact. So getting to know your birth natal chart is super important. So take what resonates, leave the rest as always. So your planet of Venus is in its home sign of Taurus for the beginning part of April. Then it's going to move into the air sign. So what is Taurus? The energy around you is of abundance in nature it's rich it's earthy it's productive yet relaxed and slow when it moves into gemini the energy is communicate communication mischievous lively witty informative stimulating exchange is possible so for me taurus i want to say take this self-love take this time that everybody's in of the pause reevaluating what your values are right and embodying that be cautious be aware of any pro procrastination um, it's wanting you to get some forward momentum with the air so maybe communicating with people that resonate with you you're finding new values possible in possibly in yourself and in your life so a lot of us are going through extreme changes and so take this and keep it into your awareness so now we're going to go with the Twin Flame Journey Tarot to go along with your message. Pay attention mid-month, and you can look at this online on the astrology chart for current. When your planet leaves its home sign of Taurus, where it's been really super comfortable, right? And it's going into an air sign, you're going to see a transition here. So this is for Taurus, for April, Divine Spirit, I give thanks in advance, always welcoming your white light, allowing me to be perfect communication for some soul empowerment messages for these beautiful souls. Queen of Swords, Sharp Assertive, Restoration, Temperance card, beautiful spirit, one more here. Okay, Queen of Swords is your first message, guys. So, Swords, sharp and assertive. A lot of you may feel this coming into the Gemini, right? Because Gemini is a thought, is a air sign. Sharp and assertive. Taurus. Values. What your values are. You got this image of, like, the wheels turning, right? But she's the queen of that. You're becoming sharp and in tune and assertive. So keep that in mind. Restoration, temperance. A lot of us being forced into the pause as we know what's going on in 2020. There's going to be a beautiful underlying energy there. If you guys can tap into that, kind of try to reevaluate what your values are. There's going to be a restoration there's going to be cause some new passions for many of you to be sparked at this time where we've been in this pause, right? And really seven of wands at the end of this message is defense mechanisms. Dropping those restrictions within yourselves could be with this when it moves into the air sign too. Don't restrict your thoughts. Don't restrict yourself, right? 
go back to this one with the self-love too with that being your ruling planet been in its home sign try to embody that pay attention to that though make sure that you're keeping yourself in check and seeing if there's any been any defense mechanisms that you guys have had to drop because that can cause a very very beautiful flame right solar plexus sacral energy for me of restoration rethinking what your values are at this time keep that in mind through the month of april what else spirit for taurus for the month of april 2020 taurus for the month of april taurus for the month of april okay well then okay guys so you got the ace of pentacles a wise investment this could be showing with this on top of it being sharp and, and, and assertive. This might be some physical action that you're taking because Ace of Pentacles is also an earth sign. So whatever it is that you guys are readjusting to at this time, because I just feel this with the wheels big time, right? Have that discernment within you. You have some really good investments that can take place for you. You got Soul Contract Justice card. So something's being restored within you with the temperance right above that there's been a restoration you're finding more equality and justice within you more balance such a beautiful deck yeah and then lastly you got the king of pentacles so ultimately it goes back to this stability you're finding a balance within you really been reevaluating when this your ruling planet's been in its home sign and happy there going into Gemini, more of a energy of communicating and can be mischievous and lively and witty and also informative. So this could be information that's coming through to you guys too with the sharp and assertive sign message that maybe a lot of you are rethinking what your values are and it's causing this restoration within you, right? To where in the towards the end of May, April you're gonna feel more stability I love that that was a soul contract and justice um, just prior to this message super super beautiful what else here love this deck guys love it Queen of Swords you kind of almost like it's a mastering of your thoughts here right because swords is an air in your thoughts wheels have been turning possibly for many of you Taurus rethinking what your values are right well venus was in its home sign of taurus really causing that restoration within you and that possibly it was the ego identity you know the defense mechanisms maybe that's something that you've healed throughout the month of april maybe that's something that you've reflected upon in the month of march with everybody kind of being forced into practicing the pause Bringing in harmony some soul contracts, right? And justice and equality within you. Creating such a, you know, wise investments. The time that you took to pause really cause, giving you the wise investment of self. And that's what I said back here to Venus. To me, ultimately, is self-love. Because when we self-love first, then we can take forward, you know, out into the community uh, a more of a equality and more love creates st stability within you um, feeling for Taurus that you've always loved the senses of course and the sensual things I know this because I'm a moon Taurus and maybe a lot of you are tapping into this intuitiveness and the reason it's all coming about and your values may be shifting and changing at this time is because you've dropped the, me the mechanism of feeling like you need to defend yourself. And that is powerful. I used to feel this myself, right? Um, because I was speaking truth way through my heart when I started loving myself, feeling like I needed to defend myself. And ultimately, at the end of the day, we don't need to defend ourselves to anything or anybody. So make that wise investment with yourself. You know, I love this with the inside, the light bulb going off with some growth in there. Super beautiful. Um, what else here? King of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. That's super beautiful to, to, to see in, in, in this spread. In the end, it's creating this beautiful stability. 
Enjoy your soul growth messages for the month of April. Hope it resonates. Tuck it away for a later time. Bring it back out and play it. See how it's transformed. Bring this all into your awareness for the month of April. And I send this to you with so much love. Namaste.